Welcome back Stoner Squad and thank you for joining me today for some more Imperial Rome going for the Molon Levy achievement. So today we will get the war going against Antigonids. They are currently fighting all the way over here and uh, they have no manpower. So um, this is a good opportunity to try and take advantage of this. Egypt would help us and all of our feudatories will join in as well. So I'm feeling fairly confident. Now the only problem I have is aggressive expansion. Of course, it's impacting my stability, and I would like to get more stability, um, but I would have to stab the pig for that. If I don't have the PI, and like the PI, I need it for so many other things as well. Um, so, yeah, I just need more PI. I, PI, please, just give me PI, anything. Just load of PI. Uh, but anyway, let's get rolling. So, I have my troops on the border. I will be declaring it for this here, just because it is Greek, all of this here. And I could probably take the Free the Greek Peoples. It would be a fairly good thing to do. There's a lot of cities here as well, which is really important, because it's going to help us with our tech and maintain it high, uh, which is going to be great. So, we'll definitely do that. I've got my 22, uh, well, my two 22k stacks here and ready. Um, so, we're just going to launch the assault. Let's do this. Atolia. They would bring in their friends, of course, we know. I'm going to bring in Egypt. Um, and let's go. Or I could, I could, I could, I could just do it for Megara. And sit on the war school. And that would be nice. And that would be easy. I could just sit on that. Um, let's cancel military access. I'll wait a month. And then I'll do it for Megara. That seems to be easy. Um, I am actually going to pull in this navy as well. Um, I'll pull them over here. Actually, no, I'll pull them over here, to be honest. Now, I want to take in Agena as well. Yeah, let's wait till the 8th. So I'll wait till the 8th of October. Okay, and now I can declare the war on you guys. I can bring in Egypt. Take Attica. They'll bring in their buddies, but I don't give a crap. You can bring them all in if you wish. Let's do this. Now's the time to do this. So we're going to take care of this crappy little tiny puny republic. And we'll deal with them fairly easily. Uh, my kind of clients or feudatures are going to deal with him there in Chalkis. I think that's Chalkis. It is. Deal with them. You guys are going to go here next. Actually, you haven't joined yet, have you, buddy? You have. So why can't you... Oh, because the strait has been blocked, you cheeky bastard. So we're going to have to go over the other side. So that's fine, we'll go down this way, and I'll go and liberate the Greek peoples of this land. I mean, why not? If I can't cross that way, then... Oh, okay, he's moved. Okay, this is good. He's moved. Let's do this. I can go this way now. Because he's actually moved out the way. I'm no longer importing dies. I am victorious over here, which means we're going to be sieging this down. We stack wiped him because he's got nowhere to go. Um... These guys are now crossed. Aha, but I can't get you guys across because this navy stopped them. So we'll go over to the other side. Um, so we'll go around this way and we'll start taking out some of this little kind of feudatory stuff down here. Unless he moves. No, he's moved. Okay, he's moved. Let's go. I want to keep them close to each other, these guys. And I need to take some of these forts as fast as possible. Now, this is the war goal, and if we take that, we get the ticking war score. His troops are way over the other side, so this will give me the opportunity to take a few things. Um, what do I need here? Can I go for anything? Um, I need a surplus of iron, but I can't get any of that. That's a shame. Where's my iron mines? How many? Every ten? I need three slaves. Let's move three slaves. So let's go... One, two, three. Okay, so now I have a surplus, another surplus here. Which I get the extra heavy infantry discipline, which is what I wanted. Um, what do I have here? Food, I'm okay. Let's go for some spices for the National Citizen Output. Let's go for... What do I want here? Do, I've got, do I have wine? I don't have wine. I do have wine. Do I have wine? I do have a surplus of wine. So let's go for... Earthenware I don't have, so I want a surplus of that. And then I'll just go for an extra set of grain here so I can feed my pops. Now. No, 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 no. Let's go. Come on. 14% here. If I can just quickly occupy these things, all of these forts here, it's going to be a lot better. A call to arms for Egypt against Lehan. But I'll join it. It's a defensive war. Yeah, I'll accept the offer. But I didn't want Lehan to... Why did they attack them? Oh, it's a rebellion. Okay, it's a rebellion, but that's fine. It's only a tiny poxy rebellion. Nothing really problematic about that. What the hell? I've got 22,000 men here attached to my army there. That's insane. Need an Orishu researcher, and we'll go for the best man for the job, which is you. 
Come on, fellas. 28% on both here. I need it to fall. I want it to fall. The quicker it falls, the better. Nope, nothing yet. 42% there. This one's on 28. Let's get you guys out here quickly. I will get rid of one unit here in order to go and take Agena. Quickly as possible. Uh, the siege over here has been won at last, so I finally got that. Now we move here. On Tyrion Devotion, we gain three stability. Thank the gods. And I'm going to stab a pig. Just to keep it rising, because aggressive expansion is making it look really kind of not go down that much. Look at that. Only 0.15 per month, so... A stamina pig would probably help get a stability up, because the way that's staying high, it's not going to go up too quick. Right, let's take this. Come on. Nope, still stuck. It is what it is. Okay, so I've got you. You're going to go back on here now. And then you guys are going to go back over here, get you back in hiding. Still stuck on 64%. Finally, the Siege of Megara has been won, so now what I'll do is I'll get you fellas over here. What was this? This siege has been won as well. That's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. That's another fort that's been taken. Um, now I'm going to want to take this as quickly as possible. As, as many of the forts as I can take. Actually, Larissa might be the way to go. Oh, I can't. I need to take this first. And then I could take Larissa. Uh, we've wiped out his units here, which is good. You, I'll assign you to the region I think I need to do. I right, join you together. So we now got that. Um, you guys are actually going to go back over here now. I don't really need you down there. Now I've got the like the war goal. We're going to get the ticking war score. Again, we have way better tech. So I'm fairly confident that we can deal with him. Um, however, I'd like to change that. But I need more... I need noble happiness here. I think. Uh, what's affecting us on pops? Yeah, I need to get my noble happiness up. So we'll go for cloth. And I'll go for... Papyrus. That should help with the noble happiness. Governor Corruption here is killing us. But he is dying. He's not dying. So I'm going to change him. Great, you're being changed. You're the Homogonid. I'll put you instead. Because you're the one that's just killing our province loyalty. Hmm. I'm going to need bigger governor forces, I think. And I'm going to need to try and stabilise some stuff before I go on, like, more conquests. So we're going to keep the discipline. It's fine for the moment. So we'll keep that. We've got a 5k stat coming down here. Whatever. Let's deal, we'll deal with them. Um, this siege has been won now, which is great news. You're going to go and try and take that. Actually, no. Let's go and force march all the way over here. Let's deal with this guy. Let's go and deal with him. There's 5k stack there. I want to kill him before. I don't want him taking my forts. Can't afford to let him take my forts. Where are the armies? I know they're moving back over there. I don't think they're still fighting over there, are they? No, they're not. They're, oh, they are. They're still fighting over there. Which is very interesting indeed. Should I go for the cultural assimilation? No, I don't. I need the gold. I'll, I'll try and go for it at the end of the war, maybe. A new military structure, you gain one martial point. Yes, why not? It helps. You're not taking this, buddy. You do realise that. So that's gone. Now I'll siege this down quickly. See if I can knock that out of the way. Um, actually, you can help. You're going to go there, and you're going to go here, and you're going to go over here, I think. Yeah, that'll do for me. Let's go and do that. Are we disloyal now? Are you kidding me? Because when did you get disloyal, buddy? Alright, let's go and take that out. Hurry up. Paphlagonia, they want to trade, be my guest. A big naval battle here, wow. Our navy's crushing them. And they're like, not if oh god, this is great. And Oh, we've absolutely crushed their like, navy, that's insane. I'll come friends with the Archon of our feudatory. Well done, my dear people. This is good. Actually, I have an idea. Uh, let's go and take some of this land as well. I can get them out of here, because this is like their feudatory. And I can like take over Naxos and stuff. That would be nice. Let's try that out. Hmm. 
What's going on now? Yeah, you need to move down here quickly, buddy. And you need to take this quickly. 14, minus 14% 14 here. Aha, but we've got our friends coming. Yes, 25k stack are coming to join us. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm going to let them do their own thing. This is good. This is good, this is good, this is good. This is why having, like, these feudatories is just so awesome. Because we have so many of them. <laughs> and it literally, literally gives us a load more men. I'm no longer importing grain. I know I'm not bothered at the moment. All I'm bothered about is trying to take as much land as I can and as quickly as possible. I'm already at 27 war score on this guy. We do a little bit better, I think. Let's keep going. 35% down here. This has been occupied, which is good stuff. A load of forts down here, though. I'm not at war with them, though, yet. But we can keep taking the rest of the stuff here. All these islands can be taken. Uh, Astakos has been won. That's great. That's good news. We're going to take this next fort down, I think. Let's just go and take this here for the province capital for the food. Well, actually, no. Let's go down here and we'll take this fort. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? So what else is going on? That's been occupied. Good. We'll move down here now. Please, this needs to fall. Then I can focus on the other forts in this area. Another Olympiad. I've imprisoned you, so I'm not sending you. I'm going to send this minor character. But I'm not sending the other dude because he's in my jail and I don't want him getting out of my jail. Anyway, you're now going to go over here. Oh, I can't. He's trapped my army. How? Oh, he hasn't. Right, now let's move. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, that's been taken. Um, now I move down here. Let's go. Speed things up. Let's occupy more stuff here. And I think aggressive expansion is just going to go through the window here. Did I take that at a really low percentage again? I think I did. I think it was like on at 7%. That was crazy. Right, stability-wise, we're going up a little bit, but I want more. I think we've actually managed to crush the Saluki's navy, which is fantastic news. Since all of our kind of feudatures here have had like a certain amount of ships, and they're just basically crushing him. Uh, so we're going to take this here. Where's the other guy doing? You're going all the way down here. Oh, there's a 20k stack there. Look. They've brought some men back. But well, hopefully you're going to catch him. Um, incendiary slave speaks in the matter. So a slave with a talent for oration by the name of Kalas. This guy, you're crap. Um... So, I think I might kill you, actually. I'll gain a bit of loyalty with Menos here, who is the governor of Thrace. So, I'm going to round him up and kill him. He's not... If he had, like, good martial stats, then I would have probably brought him in and tried to do something. But, considering he's not great, then that's why I had him killed. Right, here at 0%. 7% there now. What am I not importing in my capital, by the way? Am I losing a bonus? Yes, I'm not getting a bonus of iron. Why? Did I accept to trade off the iron? Is that what happened? Did I accept to trade it off? I mean, I have iron here. Oh, no, it pot migrated or promoted. No, let's move two in. There we go. So now I've got the surplus back. Uh, but I am going to want to kind of, like, get some more stuff. Now, what do I want, though? What do I want? Do I want extra vegetables? Probably. Move slave cost. Why not? Let's take it. And then I'm going to want maybe... Do I have papyrus? I do. I don't have, like, precious metals, do I? Let's go precious metals. <coughs> Local citizen happiness. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Come on. If I just occupy these forts, we can really pee them off. It's just going to take him forever to actually move around this. What level fort is this? It's taken a while. Level 2 fort. This one's level 1. Wow. That actually felt... He's falling at, like, basically no percentage. Which is literally insane. I'm going to go and take Oka now quickly. So I can have control of this province. Um, Epocolikos Epandrid died, and you were the commander of this... Who were you? Were you a commander? I don't think you were, actually. Um, where's my navy gone? I had a navy somewhere. Did they get destroyed? Is that what happened? I think I lost my navy. Oh, no, I didn't. All the way up here. Um, so let's go and pick these guys up. Um, I'm actually going to go here for the moment. We'll go and hide down. Oh, you're disloyal. That's why. Um, I'll grant you a holding. It's easier. I don't want to kind of waste any PI on you. So I'm sending you down to here now. 
Now I'm going to take some tech, and I'm thinking I'm going to take the popper simulation speed here quickly, just because I want it, and it's going to help us, especially with these bits here. Um, religion wise, we're good. The good thing here is that the Antigonids are pretty much converting this for us, so I don't need to worry about it when I do get this land. It's quite good. Come on, fight him. Kill him. I want my kind of feudishist to fight out his 21k stack here. You've still got no manpower, which is great. So, Lucids, you're still fighting? Mm, they've got a little manpower back, but they, when, once, once they come, it's going to be a little bit more problematic. So, I do need to peace out as quickly as possible. This is like an opportunity I couldn't really kind of let it pass. It was just too kind of good, I think, to let it pass. So, try and do. Wow. Did that fall seriously then? That was quick. Um, let's go and take Kizikos here. I want to get rid of all of these Greek like independent states on the coast. Uh, where was this? Victorious over here? Of course I was. Go and take this out now. Level 2 fort there. Polyperchon Sostratid died. And what were you? You were the Epiproxenos. I need a new one. And I don't really have too many good people. So you're the best man for the job. You'll do for the moment. Um, not that I can do much more. Um, right, let's pull these guys out now. Let's go and try and take on Naxos. I mean, I can occupy Naxos. Siege of Pergamon's won. That's fantastic news. Um, so now we go for this fort here. And then we kind of block this middle section down. Um, pirates are plundering us, I know. But I'm not really worried about it. I am definitely going to have to increase the size of my governor forces at the end of this war to keep the peace. Because at the moment... Um, well, once this war is over, we're going to have a hard time maintaining high stability. Because I am going to have a lot of unrest. But anyway, let's get you guys here on the boat. Get you guys in the Naxos. Come on, buddy. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Speed things up. Now I'll go. Oh, crap. Where's that? Oh, God. That's a big navy coming that way. Can I leg it? When do you get off the boat? Yeah, I ain't going to be able to leg it. Um, so we've got, when do you arrive? 9th of Jan, you get off on the 8th of Jan, okay. So I can actually get my troops off. Okay, and then what I'll probably do, I'll probably leg it with my navy. Um, I'll retreat all the way over to this place, if I can. Come on, let's go. Can I retreat yet? No, I can't. Well, we're retreating now. I lost a few ships, but not too many. But I've got on the island here of Naxos, which is important. Now I've got 27,000 men coming this way. And I'm going to need to pull you guys back behind here to hide. What could I take here? Let's have a look. I want to wipe you out here. I want to wipe you out there and take these islands. Okay. I'll also wipe you off this place. Okay. I could also wipe you off Naxos. No, I can't do that just yet. But I can wipe you out here. And then I can take this, this, which I want. Probably want costs as well. Yeah, I could take more. Let's keep doing this. I can keep going for a little bit. I'm fairly confident. I mean, Egypt haven't even... Oh, Egypt are attacking from the south. That's good. He lost his 15k. Well, his 25,000 men lost the battle against my feudatories, which is great. And I have barbs. Are you kidding me? Where do they come from? Am I going to have to pay these guys off? No, I'm not. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to send out this um, governor stack. To deal with these guys. They've got no morale, so I could probably go and kill them. Um, or what I will do is I'll get some more men here, actually. Um, can I actually go over here? I can't. So let's take you off governor control. I'll get you over here, I'll assign you to this governor, then we'll deal with that 14k stack. I might actually add some extra units, so 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Get a few extra going, just to be sure. Um, let's see what's going here. Barbarians, of course, they pillaged that down. I can't believe they actually crossed over to my land. What douchebags. Oh well, can't be helped. So where is... Okay, so we've got 20... Some at thousand there, but I can't help them. Oh yeah, they're legging it in time. That's good. That's good. That's good. Leg it, people. Um, this has been won. That's fantastic. Now I can move further forward, and I can probably deal with this 26k stack. Yeah, I need to go and help him. Quickly. Yeah, no, he lost that. Crap. 
He's going to absolutely beat all of my little things one by one. Um, but not if I went and helped him out on Force March here. So we're going to bring you guys down there. You can actually go down here and occupy this fort. I want more of that coastline. Uh, can I deal with this guy now? Yeah, I can. I can kill him. Let's kill him. Oh, crap. I didn't put a commander, did I? Shit. Oh, well, he's got no morale, so he should be fine. Yeah, we're fine. I'll send him back in. We'll finish him off. Um, Naxos has been taken. I'll try and take that fort there next. God, I love the power of these vassals. Um... Right, what tactic am I going for here? I might go envelopment. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a wild guess here, and I'm gonna guess envelopment. Um, you guys, when do you arrive? 30th of June. You arrive on the 29th of June. I think I can beat him. I'm gonna take a little bit of a risk. I went for the wrong tactic, which is annoying. But I am gonna send you guys on force march to help him out. Okay, he must be. Has he got a good? Yeah, he's got a fucking awesome commander. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to beat this guy. No, he's absolutely crushed me. Literally. So I'm going to retreat back to Liz McKay here. Now, this guy's a better this guy's a better commander. I might be able to beat him here. Yeah, I think I can. Here I should be able... Oh, wait. What did he go for again? He went for... I went envelopment and he went deception, I think. No, he went... Did he go shock? What did I go for? I think he went shock. I'm going to try phalanx out. There we go. I knew it. I knew it. I got the right tactic this time. Um, let's get people in. Would you, like, would you like to join me, buddies? Oh, it's just this commander is really annoying. Yeah, we're going to beat him though. Good. They joined. But good, good, good. We beat back his troops, which is what I want. I'm going to lose a bit of popularity here. We'll gain the local pop happiness in Ellis. Anything to do with pop happiness, I'll try and have. Okay, so we beat him back. That's good. Now we're going to take this fort down. What? Level 5 fort? I ain't going to be able to take that, am I? I don't think I'm going to be able to take that. I'll try, but I don't think I will be able to. Yeah, I ain't going to be able to take it. I don't have the men. Um, how many men do I need minimum to siege this fort? 4,000 men per fort level. But I need like 20,000 men. And I don't have 20,000 men there, so that has got to be gone. So I'm going to go to a face-off instead. It's the level 1 fort, which I can take. Um, I'll get you guys to reorganize back home, and then I'll pull you back as quickly as possible. You've still got no men, so he is pretty much screwed. Um, Carthage don't want to kill me, do they? No, they don't, which is a good thing. I've got a little bit of extra tech. I might go for the war score cost. I want the war score cost. Or the pop conversion speed. I don't really need the pop conversion speed yet. Unintegrated culture happiness plus three. I'll have that. Just because I have quite a few pops that aren't like integrated. So if I go to the culture here and if I kind of sort by integration status. Um, or number of pops. Sorry. I have the Lac Lacedaemonians which are integrated. But the Macedonians they aren't. I might integrate the Macedonians. I think I'm going to integrate them at the end of the war. There's a lot of them. And I think integrating them is going to be the best thing to do. I mean, they have, like, loads of them around here. And, like, it's going to be a lot easier if I integrate them. So, I think we're going to... We'll do it at the end of the war. We'll get the integration kind of thing going. Court with handed. So, hold the front of the court. Chrysippos Adjad is a sorry sight. Um, court with a... What, a mace in hand? He's been ready to strike down a Lididas. Hmm. Who is Zopirion Hermogenid and Leodidas? Let's have a look who these guys are. Um, Zopirion is the head of the family, so I ain't pissing him off. So We'll take the other one. Yeah, I'm not peeing off the head of the family. That's not going to work. I need a new Archiatros now. I'll put one of the Scorn family members. Anyone, I'm not bothered. You will be just fine just to get rid of the Scorn family. I think the Archiatros kind of position is just a... just. It's, a, it's one of the worst positions in government. It's pretty crap. Um, all this has been done. What can I piece out for now? So, I want this. I want these islands. I want Chalkis. I want Naxos and these little islands here. 
for the moment, okay? Uh, the next thing I'm going to want is this place. I'm going to want this as well. You won't let me have that? Are you kidding me? Hmm. Um, you guys are back home. You're going to reorganize quickly. Let's go all the way around here. I can't believe it's still... It won't let me take a lot of land, will he? He literally won't let me take a lot of land. Let's try and occupy this. Can I separate piece you guys? I can't because you're subject to him. So that's the reason why. Shame I can't separate piece them all out. Siege of Eos has been won. That is fantastic. We're going to take these out now. The rest of the land. Yeah, he's pulling in with a lot of extra men back now. So I might actually peace out. What can I peace out for? I mean, I would like this. And this. Maybe even this. Possibly with this. And some of this. Yeah, it's too much. And I don't want to kind of get this to drag on. I don't want this to drag on for as long as it can drag on. So I'm actually going to keep this here so I can keep declaring war on it. And it's just going to be an easy war goal. So I'll, wipe, I'll take this, okay, and I'll take this island here because it's a pain. These I'll leave for the moment. I'm not entirely bothered. I would like to take this. They're Greek pops, and I can have them under my control. I could probably take this as well. And maybe go for, like, this, which I can. Can I have that with it as well? No, I can't. That's a shame, but that doesn't matter. So I'll take this, take this place, we'll take this here. That's, like, more than enough. I could probably take Kios. No, I can't. Kazikos. So I have to take that in another war. Um, but I can take these islands. I can take Chalkis. And I can probably take... No, I can't take them. Well, this gives me 32 aggressive expansion. I do get a nice big chunk of land. And I get these populous, like, these populated cities down here. And I'm just going to keep... I'll use, like, Megara as the back way into the Antigonids. Can I get you to break a treaty or something? I can't get you to, like, break your alliance, can I? Or, can I do anything to the Seleucids here? Can I, like, super peace for you? No, I can't do anything with you. Um... Okay, so we'll just um, we'll leave it at that. We'll take this. I'll take these two here just to kind of keep that. This I'm going to hand over to my clients. This I'll give to Athens as well, by the way. I think it's part of their area. And we'll take this. We'll take this. And I'll take this bit here. And I'll take this bit. Shame I can't take that. I really would like to have that. I'll take this. Oh. So it looks like that's all I am going to be able to take. But it is still something, and I'll happily take it. So, we still get 32 aggressive expansion for all this, but whatever, let's just have it anyway. Um, I don't give anyone else anything, do I? No, I don't. So let's just take it. I think it's the best thing I can do. And we'll just keep declaring war on Megara, so let's do it. Again, I don't want the kind of war to last forever. So, if it does, because I don't really have that much manpower. But anyway, we'll pass judgment on the families. I'm going to welcome them all in. At least we get some extra characters, and which I'm quite happy to have. Uh, but there we started kind of getting a nice foothold over on the Antigonids here, which is exactly what I wanted. It was just a war of opportunity, and now I probably need to kind of spend some time getting aggressive expansion down, which is really high. But I am going to get rid of this fort here. I'm going to get rid of the fort here in Bidos. Um, I'll probably leave a fort in Bidon, I think. Um, so many places. Um, here I'll move the province capital down to this place. I think Elea's a pretty good area to have it. Well, I can't because I'm at war, by the way. Um, here, I'm going to get rid of... I don't really need that. Here, I'm going to get rid of the marketplace. We'll go for a fortress on the border. Um, Kaim, I don't really need one. Um, where next? Larissa here. I'm probably going to build something. But this one I'll get rid of in High Heiser. Sorry, not Larissa, but Heiser. Heiser, I'll go for fort. Here, I'm going to keep that fort there as well. Because this blocks the border quite nicely. And um, Kazikos here, I will probably get rid. Oh no, I don't own that, do I? Of course. It looked like I do, but I don't. 
And I think that's about it. This fort here I can probably get rid of. I don't know why I placed that there. But I'll get rid of this fort here. Don't need that one. Um, <laughs> Is that what I wanted to do? I think it might be. You guys are going to stay over on this side. You're going to go and stay over in... Well, where you are here and reorganize, by the way. You're going to stay like that. Um, you guys need to get back home. So I'll probably bring you guys over here. And we're going to pick you fellas up. Some pirates there, though, which is really annoying. Um, Athens want to trade. Here, Athens, I'm going to hand this to you. So I will send over actions. I will sell... Oh, it's influence, isn't it? It is influence. There we go. I'll sell territory to you. I'll sell this. You can have that. And I'll also sell to you this to Chalkis. You can have that. We can have Chalkis. I'll sell that to Orios here. Okay. So there we go. Now you have more like land, which means more men for us. Um, so it's nice to know that they actually provide us with 25,000 soldiers in the war. That is like substantial. Uh, but anyway, let's pull you guys over here. I'll pull you guys off onto Zibot. You can go back home. Um, and I will place you guys over into the port of Agassai. And I do need to probably get some more governor forces going. So, you are going to be the governor of Macedonia. So, I need to rename you so I actually know what I'm doing. Because otherwise I'll be totally lost. So, Macedonia governor. Okay, so that's done. So now I've got a decent governor force down here. You're going to go in Pella. That's where you're going to stay. Um, you are going to be called Illyria governor. So I like kind of organising stuff and I like kind of knowing what's what. Um, you need to be Bithynia governor. I need a new governor force down there, don't I? Bithynia governor. Oh, crap. There we go. And I'm going to need a governor force down here. And I'm going to need a decent sized one. Um, and we are going to go with archers, the cheapest of units. One, two, three, four, five. And I'll go for like some light infantry. One, two, three, four, five. That's more than enough. Um, that gives me a little 10k governor stack there. Oh, and by the way, this one, I need to name you. Is it Europa? No, it's Thrace. There we go. Thrace governor. That's what you'll be called. Thrace governor. Done and dusted. So everything's nice and organized. And I'm going to make a cut in the video here, people. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, if you enjoyed things, of course, please don't hesitate to hit that like button down below. It really does help get the videos out there. And of course, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, then what are you waiting for? Go and hit that subscribe button so you'll never miss an Imperative Rome video. But with that said and done, thank you so much for joining me. And I will hopefully catch you all in the next one. Bye for now.